It was my privilege last spring to watch the ready workers lay out and excavate and ultimately plant this beautiful garden. And many congregants, some of whom are here this morning, water the plants over a very hot summer. We see the beautiful results of all their commitment. And when our congregants, and particularly our children, see this garden, they will learn that environmental sustainability is not just something to learn about in school, but something to act upon in our community. They will learn the importance of working together as a community. In the past four years, I've worked with the most amazing group of people. I've learned how to handle challenging situations on the job, and I've had the opportunity to grow from a crew member to a crew leader. I'm very proud to be part of READY, not just for what we do for the environment, but also because of how we accomplish this work. This is really inspiring, and it you know, really helps me remember why I moved back to Howard County, to live in a place where we have the political and the social will and the economic means to bring together groups like this and come up with products like this that serve the people, serve the environment, serve not just any group of people, but plenty of groups of people. This is not partisan, folks. You can be Republican, you can be Democrat, you can be Independent, you can be Christian, you can be Gentile, I mean, you can be Jewish, you can be Muslim, you can be whatever. You can still care about the environment, you can care about people and respect people um, all the time. And so I guess that's the message I want to make people know. I know I was elected, people thought, oh my gosh, it's going to be terrible, it's a Republican. Um, I just want you to know that's not going to happen, you know. It's so important how this touches so many lives and the environment. We are in this community and have been for so long committed to the environment and when we show it and when we do things like this uh, and making a difference um, it does take one step at a time. Rain gardens like this, rain gardens like the one at Temple Isaiah, rain gardens in the future and the work that we do here has an immediate and dramatic effect all the way down the watershed and into the bay. As the prophet Amos said, let justice flow like, a, like water and righteousness like unfailing streams. So let us have an unfailing stream and may the water that we pour today affirm our unfailing commitment to the earth placed in our care, to the rights of human dignity and the dignity of meaningful work, and to building and sustaining not only environmentally sustainable community, but a just community that sustains all of its citizens and empowers them in a way in which no one is left behind. Yes. And may the water that we poured out today flow as a blessing, not just for this garden, but also for us and for all who live here in Howard County. And let us say, Amen. Amen. Amen.